Greetings, Willow Le Machant here with your Awakening Your Consciousness Tarot reading for today. And this is for Thursday, March 21st. And I'm hoping that the Divine Source can touch you in some way today to help guide you through her message. So let me go ahead and get started shuffling these cards. And we'll see what she would like us to know for today. what she has in store for us today, what she wants us to know. Okay. So the first card for today is the Ten of Pentacles. Now the Ten of Pentacles is a card of abundance. So you may feel very good today. You may feel like you're really on track for your spiritual growth. You may feel like even in the mundane and the material world, you've got pretty much everything you want. You could feel very safe and secure. But understand that life is about cycles. The number 10 cards are the endings, but they can be also the beginnings. So when we look at this, you have to understand that just because you think you've got all the knowledge, all the wisdom that you need spiritually, doesn't mean you're done. Because something's going to pop up, a message is going to pop up, and you're going to want to learn something new. It's all about cycles. We might have all that that we want, and then we start on our path to find that next thing. So it doesn't matter if it's a mundane thing or if it's a spiritual thing. So today, understand, you may feel like you have everything all under control. You've got your spirit spiritual mind in the right place you've got all your wisdom and the next thing you know oh you see a new book you see somebody else's per perspective on something you see a new way to do something you might want to try something else spiritually and then you're going to try to work towards that just understand it is all about cycles and that is how we grow so you may feel good now it's great. You're still going to feel great, but there may be more for you to learn yet. And it's going to pop up and you're going to want to go and gather that knowledge and that wisdom as well. So let's take a look at the next card. Today, we have the reversed moon. I think we had that earlier in the week. But the reversed moon is about paying attention to our intuition, our gut feelings, our dreams. We may be being given some messages and it has to do with something new like the new moon the new beginning when we just talked about the ten of pentacles and how there might be something new that we want to bring in as well so it is a constant journey we are constantly learning and we must be constantly aware of what we are being told or shown for our messages from the divine. She can reach out in many ways. If you're thinking, you know, what should I do next? Is there something I need to know? You might see a, a billboard. You might see an ad on TV. You may be watching YouTube and something pops up and you're like, oh, that looks interesting. There's always going to be something new. You will never stop learning until the day you leave this physical body. And then you will be going to the next level. And then you will have that choice to come back in and learn more if you choose to. So let's take a look at your third card. Now with new things, new beginnings, um, 
we also may find that some of our old things are not as good of a match as they used to be. Sometimes it's the way we thought. Sometimes it was, well, we used to do this way and now we should do it that way. Sometimes people who are healers learn different modalities and find that they pick pick uh, bits and pieces from different modalities to create their own healing methods. It doesn't matter. Everybody's different. But sometimes we have to let go of the old stuff in order to bring in the new stuff. And sometimes the old stuff's holding us back from the new stuff that we need. So we have to be willing to keep an open mind to changes and to new things that we are being given from the divine. You never know. There may be a new book that comes out that you need to read. You may think that aliens are silly to think about and then others are like, but I've seen them. Everybody's different. Never think that your old stuff is the only way. Sometimes you gotta bring in the new. So out with the old, no longer good matches in our life and bring in some good ones, okay? So let's just kind of go over these again. So remember, 10 of Pentacles, you could feel very safe and secure. You may feel that your journey is exactly what it is supposed to be, that you've gotten everything that you need, and then you see something new that you want to bring in something else you want to learn, something else that you need that knowledge about. And it's all about cycles. And you'll be going on another cycle coming up. Because you got the moon reversed, which is a new beginning, like the new moons. And so pay attention to your intuition, pay attention to your dreams. You're going to be guided. And let go of the old things that don't match you so well. The things that aren't as beneficial as they once were. The way that you did something may not be the way that you're going to continue to do that something. So be willing to bring in the new and to release the old today. And I hope that helps. I hope that guides you. I hope it gives you some wisdom for the day. Something to think about on your journey. If you are seeking a personal reading... You can contact me through my website at willowlamachant.com. Um, that address, that link is down below in the description of the video. And if you would like a personal reading with me, I am available from 11 a.m. till 11 p.m. Central Standard Time daily. And I hope you find a lot of wisdom today on your journey. And until next time, be blessed.